to another day of fun in learning science. I'm Teacher John and I will be your teacher for today. Are you ready? If so, come on, let's begin! What do you need to know? The waste that we generate per day is more than what landfills can accommodate. This is why some wastes are left uncollected in different places. Uncollected waste causes land, water, and air pollution. And any form of pollution is harmful to all organisms. Therefore, we should practice 5 R's to manage waste in the environment and help make our surroundings clean and tidy. One of these 5 R's is recycling, which involves collecting and processing materials that would be thrown away as trash, and turning them into new products with different use or purpose from its original form. Recycling can be beneficial to our community and to the environment. Why should we recycle? What benefits do we get from recycling? Recycling reduces the waste sent to designated dumping areas or landfills. It results in the conservation of our natural resources such as lumber, water, and other minerals. It also prevents pollution by reducing the need to collect new materials. After going through this module, you will design a product out of local and recyclable materials to make useful products by understanding the waste management practices 5 R's, the Reduce, Reuse, Recycle, Repair, or Recover. This module is divided into three lessons, namely, Lesson 1, How Can We Manage Our Waste? The 5 R's Technique which we are going to discuss today. Lesson 2, Importance of Practicing the 5 R's. And Lesson 3, Designing a Product Out of Local and Recyclable Materials. Before we proceed to our main lesson, let us have first your first activity, so that I will know what you already know. Directions draw a happy face if the picture shows a recycled material and a sad face if it's not. Write your answer on your notebook. Number 2. Flowers in your garden. 3. Paper turns into a flower vase. 4. Plastic turns into bag. And number five, bag. Now let's proceed to your next activity directions. Write the letter of the best answer. Number six, why are some waste in other places left uncollected? A. The landfills have a lot of space for the waste. B. The collected waste products are fewer every day. C. The landfills cannot accommodate all the waste. And D. The collected waste products are burned every day. Number 7. What will happen to uncollected waste? A. It can produce waste. B. It can cause pollution. C. It can produce plastic. And D. It can cause garbage. 8. Why is it important to use the 5 R's technique? A. It can harm living things. B. It can produce more waste. C. It can pollute the environment. And D. It can lessen the waste every day. 9. What is the main reason for practicing the 5 R's? A. To solve or prevent environmental problems. B. To worsen the environmental problems. C. To throw the garbage everywhere. And D to pile more trash in the landfill. Number 10, what are the components of the 5 R's techniques? A. Reducing, remaking, recycling, recovering, refilling. B. Reselling, reducing, remaking, recovering, repairing. C. 
reducing, reusing, recycling, recovering, and repairing, and D, reusing, reselling, refilling, recovering, and repairing. Now, let's check your work. For letter A activity, number 1, happy face, 2, sad, 3, happy, 4, happy, and number 5, sad face. For letter B, number 1, C, 2, B, 3, D, 4, A, and number 5, C. Okay, count the number of correct answer. If you got a high score, then very good. If not, it's okay because we are just going to discuss the lesson later. For today's lesson, we are going to discuss lesson 1, How can we manage our waste? The 5 R's technique. Okay, now let's have this activity. Study the pictures of the new products created or made and identify what common materials are used. Take a look at the picture, then answer the following questions. Number one, what materials are shown in the picture and what are they made of? Number two, where can we find these materials? And number three, are these materials common in our locality? Okay, take a look again at the pictures. The following shows the applications of 5 R's. Label them correspondingly with reduced, reused, recycled, repaired, or recovered. Let me see what you know about the 5 R's technique. Number 1. Echo bags. Number 2. Scrap wood as fence. Number 3. Tires remodeled into outdoor seats. 4. Used jars made as containers and canisters. And number 5. Animal manure. Let's check again your work. For number 1, reduce. Number 2, it can be a repair or reduce. 3. Recycle. 4. Reuse. And number 5. Recover. Now, for you to better understand the lesson, so let's talk about it. What is it? What are the different ways of managing waste? What are the specific materials that can be reduced, reused, recycled, repaired, or recovered? There are strategies that can be used in handling waste materials found in our home and community. This technique is composed of five ways we can manage our waste and known as the five R's. Now let's talk about it one by one. Number one, reducing. When we say reducing, we are decreasing the number of materials to be used. For example, using alternative materials such as eco bags instead of plastic cellophane to minimize waste from plastics. Number two, reusing. To use again the material for the same purpose such as using old but usable shoes. Another example of uh, materials that can be reused are the plastic bottles. When you have plastic bottles, you can reuse it by putting water again on it. Number three, recycling. Producing new products out of discarded materials such as making decorations. So, for example, when uh, making flower base out of use or scrap papers or figurines also you can also um, turn plastic bottles into flower pot or pencil holder so those are examples of materials that can be recycled number four recovery making the most out of the waste by generating energy such as using peelings of fruits and vegetables as plant fertilizers Another example is the animal manure. When we use those manure into organic fertilizer. And number five, repairing. Repairing is fixing broken things so that they can be used again, such as sewing and mending old clothes. Examples also are 
fixing broken chairs or broken table. Another example is when you fix your bag. As a whole, the 5 R's technique helps in minimizing garbage and to solve or prevent environmental problems such as pollution in air, water, and land. Now, think of some situations in your home or community that you have observed or experienced that use the 5 R's technique. Have you practiced using the 5 R's techniques at home, in your community? If yes, you and your family are certainly caring for the environment. Congratulations! Now, let's answer Activity 1 directions. Copy the table and write the number of the sentence in the appropriate column as to reduce, reuse, recycle, repair, and recover. Number 1. All genes were donated to the victims of the typhoon. Number 2. Jason placed and carried his groceries in a big plastic grocery bag. 3. Margaret used empty bottles as flower pots. 4. Instead of buying a new bag for the coming school days, Denise washed and fixed her old one. 5. Mr. Cruz collected chicken manure in his poultry and gave it to a shop that can convert biodegradable materials. Okay, now let's check again your answer. So, for reduce, that is number 2. Reuse, that is number 1. Recycle, number 3. Repair, number 4. And number 5 is recover. Now, let's have activity 2. Directions answer the puzzle with different waste management technique. Base your answer from the description below. So, for across, number 1 simply means lessen the use of unnecessary materials. Number 2, fixing or restoring broken materials to be used again. Down. 3. Processing the waste materials to make another product. 4. To use again if not by you, then by others. And number 5. Taking energy or materials from waste that cannot be used. Now let's answer activity 2. So there are clue words in the statement for you to answer it correctly. So for number 1, reduce. The clue word is to lessen. Number two, repair. Clue words are fixing or restoring. Number three, recycle. The clue words here is to make another product. Four, reuse. Of course, to use again. And number five, recover. Taking energy from materials or from waste materials. Okay class, that ends our lesson today. I hope you learned a lot from this video. For more video updates, please subscribe to my channel, click the notification bell, and share it to your friends. Thank you for watching!